everybody. David Fierstein, Power Call Sirens, Powercast. We are on the line. Uh, we're going to do some custom graphics with a member of Pikesville Volunteer Fire Company, Jason Broth. He's asked to do a custom Maltese cross to replace one that looks like it's a bit damaged on his window. So we're going to do a, a quick power cast and uh, go over some uh, graphic customizations. All we ask is that you share this post. You give us a thumbs up. Let us know that you like it. Tell all your friends that we do this kind of thing. If you haven't been on PowerCast before, basically it's a free service where you can take any of the graphics that we have and you can customize it live online in front of our community and our world. Um, the more people know about this, the, the, the more we'll do this. And uh, it's a really, we think it's a really great service to be able to show you all what we do and how we do it. So please share this with your friends. Uh, give us a thumbs up if you like it. Uh, subscribe to our Facebook and our YouTube channel. Uh, the way you can... Uh, Book a time as you can go onto our Facebook page. You can uh, our Power Call Sirens Facebook page. There's a book now button. You can choose a time slot. We'll contact you prior to that time slot. It's about a 15 minute time slot, anywhere from five minutes to 15 minutes, and we'll go over customizing whatever decal you're interested in, and uh, everybody else around our community to, will watch. So, Jason, can you hear me okay? I can. Okay. And if you get a run in the middle, of, uh, if you get a run in the middle of our session, just let me know, and we'll. Uh, and we'll take it over from there. So Jason's on duty now, so if he gets a call, he'll have to leave. But uh, we all know how that works. All right, so you can see us okay, Jason, on your side? Yes, sir. Okay, so we're going uh, to start with a screen share with a, uh, with a blank template. And just give me one second to, uh, to pop onto this. All right, so... There's going to be a little bit of a lag and a delay just because we're in Virginia and everybody else is through the net, so eventually you'll be able to see exactly what it is that we're doing. There's a, there might just be a little bit of a del, del, bleh, there might be a little bit of a delay on there. So I'm going to bring up a basic Maltese cross, Jay, and uh, what I'm going to do first, brothers, I'm going to find your picture that you sent me, and uh, I'm going to I'm going to copy that picture so we can bring that into our system and everybody else can see it. So bear with me one second. Do a little house cleaning here to bring this online. Yeah, so this one, this one doesn't owe me a penny. It's been on the car for about uh, 12 years now. Oh. <laughs> that's, a good, that's a good thing. Okay. So you will see, brother, basically I'm going to, you're going to see in a, in a second, you're going to see that decal picture uh, pop on your screen. Just let me know when you see that, okay? I got you. Well, we have the options, brother. With, with our stuff, with everything that I do, I have the options of regular or reflective material. So when you, when we're done with this, when we post this on our website, the uh, the options you'll have for purchasing will be size and material. So we've always done just regular vinyl and reflective vinyl. It just uh, it's just a matter of what you choose to do when you order it. So, all right. So. Yeah, the reflective is the best 3M reflective on the market. It'll probably outlast your vehicle unless you scrape it off. It's the it's the best stuff out there. It's the same vinyl you see on the side of fire trucks and police cars and ambulances and everything like that. So it's it's the best out there. Perfect. All right, so I'm going to take the hydrant out because I know that's not what you have in there. And you're looking to have an EMS star put on the right hand side, uh, like the like the other one, correct? Right. So the question that we had was, is it possible to fit both? So since it's a single color decal, we have cer only certain things that we can put on there. Um, and again, it depends on the size. Like I've got a spreader that, uh, that looks like this. You'll see it come on the screen here in just a second. Let me, know, let me know when that pops up on the screen. Right now on my side, I've got a picture of Jason's decal. I've got a picture of my graphic, and then I've got a picture of a spreader on there. So let me know when you see that, okay? I got you. I got the spreader, yep. Okay. So, so if you do a larger decal, it's easy to do that. But when you do a really, really small decal, all those little areas might be a little challenging to pull out because you've got to make that really small. So a lot of times, brother, what we'll do is we'll take like the little pieces out of there and we'll just create like a, we'll create like a, I'll, I'll show you what we do. It'll pop up on your screen in just a second. 
we create a more of a generic version of the spreader that makes it easier to cut with vinyl. So let me know when you see me make those changes. Oh, sorry about that. Let me uh, let me move over here a little bit. It'll it'll populate here in just a second. So, like I said, depending on the size that you do will depend on what can be done. Most of the time when you do this decal, it has to be just a solid piece because you can't weed out those little tiny pieces. It's just too small. Right. So, um... So recommendations have always been, and you're going to see me make some changes on the screen here as it pops up. And if we go any smaller than that, to try and fit a small piece in there as well. Yeah, I mean, it's, gonna it's not going to really going to work. Yeah, I mean, especially if you're doing like a five or a six inch decal, there's not really a lot of room for, uh, for that in there. So I'll, right, I'll, 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 I'll give you, a, I'll show you another option, which, which might be which might be better for you. Um, let me bring up a, a graphic here. Just... Yeah, we don't want to our out, oh no. Yeah, no, wait. Them... No, wait till you see what I do. I'm going to I'm going to try something here. Just give me a second to custom create. So, uh, da, da, da. So for everybody watching, you're basically going to see me just kind of create something for him uh, just to to see to give some ideas of what it is we're looking to do. He basically needs an EMS star in there, so I'm going to throw an idea at you, and you just let me know what you think. So my idea initially is to put uh, put an EMS star in the middle, and put the number 32 within that EMS star. Just an idea. And again, if you don't like the idea, that's totally cool. I just like to throw it out that way, just to see if it's something that might work for you. Let me know when that populates up. <clears throat> I got you. So that's an I that's an idea, brother. You can do you can you can still keep the the EMS star in the middle. You can put the thirty two in the middle. You get that little hearse tool down there. We can make that hearse tool a little bit bigger if we want. Yeah, I'm walking into the kitchen. Give me a sec. Yep, no worries. No worries. So Jason's discussing with all his guys. Yeah, I'm sorry, say that one more time for me. If we use the, where you have line three, yep. and instead of putting words down there, put the star into that one, and then where it says fire, we did Pikesville VFC in just that top one. All right, I'm working on, I'm doing that as we speak. Word only in the top part of the star. What would you want in the middle again? Just the 32? Okay, I'm, I'm designing that as we speak, so that'll populate on your side here real shortly. Right, 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 yeah. And then, right, and then it's like the center, the way I sent it to you with engine squad medic. And what would you want on the top line again, Pikesville? Yeah, Pikesville. I mean, we could just do Pikesville volunteer. Well, in the top, in the, in the top leaf, you only have a certain amount of space. So when you see the word Pikesville in there. VFC, sorry, we're in the kitchen. We got a lot more noise going on than where I was before. That's all right. Remember that when you have a... Uh, Remember that when you have a lot of text in the top line, the text is going to get a whole lot smaller. So if you wanted something other than Pikesville in the top, my recommendation would be to put it on a second line because if you try to put Pikesville VFC in that top line, you're going to have to squeeze it in a whole lot more to make it fit. Right, no, can you do it? Yeah, so I'm just 
So if you did on a second line underneath Pikesville. What would you want to put? Oh. Pikesville VOL or Vike, what were you looking to say? Uh, can you curve the Pikesville yep. up yep. a little bit and then yeah, VOL, fire CO like we had on the other one? All right, give me a second. And then maybe curve it to follow the curve yep. of the Maltese? Absolutely, yep. You'll see that uh you'll see that come up on your screen here shortly as I'm doing it. Yeah, doing a six inch just doing a six inch it'll be good because you'll easily be able to put that information in there because it'll be such a big sticker. So what do you think of something like that? Let me know when that populates on your side. Now, with this truck on yours, do you want tower instead? Tower, correct. Okay. Give me just a second here. I'm working on that as we speak, so you'll see it change on your yeah. side. So while everybody's watching, we're just doing customizations on this Maltese cross. There's all kinds of things that everybody can do to these Maltese crosses. So for those that are watching, uh, if you're interested in doing one of these, this is what the PowerCast is all about, letting you see what it is and how it works. And then, Jace, what do you want at the bottom there? You want medic? Squad medic. Squad medic. And it gives you the capability to arch everything. So we can pretty much do anything we want with these Maltese crosses. And again, the bigger the better. So if you do a, if you ended up doing like a four inch or a three inch with this, it'd be really hard to see all the letters because they're so tiny. So they're talking about a six inch decal, which works really, really well. This will come out really sharp on a six inch sticker. All right, so yeah, I, yeah, can you add another space and kind of between squad medic yep. and engine tower? Got it. Yep, just did that. Let me know when that populates for you. Okay, you want another space? Between the E from in, the second E of engine and the T of tower, can we space that one and the squad D and the M medic space that one more? Say that one more time now. A little separation between the engine tower and squad medic. Gotcha, okay. The type right would be a double space. Yep, no worries. <laughs> Let me know when that populates up on your side there. Yeah, there you go, perfect. Top looks good. Yep. Oh, definitely. Yep. That's fine. That's sharp, yeah. That's And you, as you see, I did the 32 in the normal engine style font that we do. It's called a college or a varsity font. It just looks a lot better than your standard, you know, aerial 32 like you had in yours. So you're, so that's, uh, any other changes you want to make to that? Any other alterations or anything that you're looking for? Or is that exactly what you're looking for? Well, I got four of us here, so, uh... <laughs> Yeah, you'll you'll have color options on the website to do any uh to do any kind of colors that you want. So you'll have you'll have the options of white and red and green and reflective, non reflective. You'll have all those options. Right. So, so, so if someone's ordering it on their own, they can change anything in here color wise to tell you what they want. It, it the the whole decal is going to be one color. So if they can't they can't change like a color of this and a color of that. It could it could come in red. It can come in white. It can come in green. It can come in blue. They can change those colors. If they want to go in there and they want to alter the text, that's considered a customization. So it would have to be redone. But yeah, they they have the option if they wanted to go in there and they wanted to manipulate something and they wanted to change something up. But you always have the options to do that with my stuff. It just costs a little bit additional to do that since we're not just going in here and printing it. We're actually going in, changing it, and then having to redo it. But yes, definitely. So if I'm going if I'm going bulk, if we're going to put in a company order, right? And we could just go straight up white reflective. Yep. And order you know two dozen or whatever. It yep. Is. And I don't know if you're talk about this on live or, or calls for this. Um, well, here, 
let me let me let, 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 let me show you because it's something that uh, I'll show you because it's uh, it, it's it's normal normal uh, it's normal prices for everything which I'll show you it'll pop the website's gonna populate on the screen here so let me know when you you see that so if you do a six inch reflective a six inch reflective if you're just buying one okay one two three as it for a custom graphic is eight dollars and ninety nine cents for a ref and that's uh Actually, I'm sorry. I'm on the custom one. Sorry about that. Give me a second. Da, da, da. I shouldn't be on the custom ones. Bear with me a minute. Custom ones have different prices because somebody actually customizes them online. But the benefit of doing it on the Powercast is you don't ha you don't pay that customization fee because we're doing it live with you. So a six-inch reflective is generally about nine to nine dollars and fifty cents for the Scotchlight material for one. So you'll see when I scroll down on the screen here, there's a quantity discount. Uh, box in there which is automatic on the website so if you did 24 of those it's going to give you 5% off if you did 36 of them it's 7% off remember that when you go reflective you're paying for that scotch light fee it's cheaper to do non-reflective and they last just as long but some people like reflective some people like non-reflective reflective is definitely more expensive because it's the best reflective on the market um, but you'll uh, you have the option between regular and, and reflective. It just depends on what you want. If some of your guys don't care about reflective, it's it's like two and a half dollars cheaper to go non-reflective, and it's still the best white three M reflect. Uh, it's still the best white three M reflective on the market. It's just not reflective. Got it. So you're look, so we're looking at uh, between seven fifty and ten dollars. You're looking at you look at between seven. It's a uh, let me see. It's between so a seven inch non-reflective it's re it's basically going to be between seven and nine fifty roughly seven and nine dollars depending on which one you go for plus whatever quantity discounts you put in there okay so most people and, do and mo most people what's that i was gonna say and ours will be online the one we just did will be online right people could order it on their own <clears> if they chose. right once you give me the go ahead and once we complete the video here basically within five minutes i'll have an email to you with a link that you can uh you can go on there and order it and, uh, okay, so it won't be available. It, won't, it wouldn't be available that someone could just go online without our permission. If you want it, if you uh, if you guys want to put it online and you want it to be private, we can make it private to where you have to physically go into the website and type something to find it. We have that option. And uh, generally, when somebody orders one of these decals, if they're not from the same state, our system kind of flags it and says, like, if, if you're from Maryland and somebody from Arkansas comes in a little thing pops up on my screen and says you know who is this person you know it, it's not it's all state based so if somebody from if somebody from pennsylvania chimes in from my company in virginia my little thing comes up and it says virginia pennsylvania so i know that i basically have to make sure it's okay but if it's private you don't have to worry about that because yeah, they because they can that, uh, they, i agree with it yeah we, just, we want it just us so, and what will probably happen is we'll just do it by uh, company order sure and I'll just, you know, I'll be in touch with you, and, you know, we'll order, you know, a couple dozen of them because we'll just, you know, at a meeting. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, something like that. I'll, I'll, I'll pull it up. If you, yeah, you said you can email me a link, so this way Correct. I can actually open that link and print the copy right. on paper. Correct, yep. And then I can... I can do that, right? I'll print the copy on paper to show it. I'll send you a when I when I send you the link, you'll actually you'll also get a picture of it, a really high high resolution picture of it within that email. So you you'll be able to click on that and you'll be able to print that out because it's a really high high quality image. Perfect. That's exactly what I need in order to be able to get an order taken. Yep. And uh, and then I'll be able to come in to you with a uh, a larger volume order. Yeah. So the way the private works on our website for everybody else that's watching is you basically everybody on our website has a profile or an, I want to say an account. So in order to see something private, you'll have to log into your account on our website in order to click on it. People may see it on our website, but if if unless you physically are logged in, you can't they can click on it, but it's not going to do anything. So in order to actually be able to order this, you're going to have to log into your account on our website with your username and password, and then you'll be able to access that decal. That's the way that works. So, Got it. okay. So, uh, t -t 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 any other questions? I think that looks great. Okay, sweet. Like I said, I've got this saved. It'll be saved here forever. And uh, what it will do is, when, like I said, when we end this, I will, uh, I'll send you a, uh, I'll send you a link, and then uh, whenever you're ready to order, feel free to either do it online or give me a call, and uh, and uh, we'll go from there. And if you need to do any of these else in the future, you know, feel free to hit me up. Great, Dave. Thanks so much. You've been super helpful. Yeah, man. Today. This was wonderful to do. No problem. We'll talk to you soon. Take All right. Care. Take care. Bye-bye. All right. Bye-bye. All right. So 
that is a great uh, that was a great session of Powercast. Somebody bringing in a brand new Maltese cross, being able to customize it, and uh, we were actually able to have them with the voice on here before we were using the phone, and it was kind of aimed at the microphone. We've integrated Skype on this last uh, session. So it was you were able to hear him, and he was able to hear us, and that was my whole goal was uh, the, the, the trials and tribulations of when we started this was I wanted people to be able to hear the customer as long as the customer was okay with that. So uh, that was really uh, good. So a lot of the stuff we'll be doing, we'll be doing on Skype. So if you use Skype, you're always welcome to find us. We'll have that information posted on our website and on our, uh, and on our Facebook and everything. So uh, as I mentioned to you all before, uh, this is PowerCast. It is a live online session where you can basically go into our Facebook page and you can click the book now. I'm going to. So you can see here how you can book now and that will give you a time slot to where you can basically log on with me. Uh, we'll, do, we'll make a custom graphic. It could be any graphic I want. It could be a template I, that you have on the website that you can customize text just like we did with Jason's. So if anybody is interested in doing that, it's totally free of charge. And again, if you place an order with me afterwards, great. If you don't, I appreciate you coming on. The whole point is to actually let people know that they can come on to this live service. They can draw whatever they want from one of our templates and one of our graphics. They can see what it looks like. They can send it to their friends. Uh, and if you decide to order one down the road, that's great. It'll be on the website for you. Uh, if you don't, like I said, very much appreciate you coming on and uh, and just doing some customizations. The more that we do the PowerCast, the more you share it and the more you like it and tell your friends about it, the more other people will log on and see it. And uh, and that will hope, help uh, generate uh, some really cool stuff for our business and for everybody else around our community. So if you have any questions about any of this, feel free to drop us a Facebook message. You can drop us a uh, you can drop us an email to our support at powercallsirens.com, but I think the best thing to do is uh, is hit us up with uh, with uh, with any messages that you might have. We appreciate your time, and we will see everybody soon. Hope you all have a great rest of your day. Take care.